Uh, this is Super Mole, Steve Super Mole Retro. I got my second Grant's Comics mystery box here. Uh, oops, sorry, got to be. got to be and no editing skills to get it out of there. <laughs> like a little bit to be. Let's see. Well, I got two big. Oh, okay. I, I understand what he did. Yeah, I remember now. All right. There's a, if you bought two, which I did, you're supposed to get a t-shirt. And since the buddy Mole here is a, a bigger guy, he didn't have my size of shirt. So he threw me in some bonus books, which is fine by me because I got plenty of shirts. So I don't know if we should open that first or last. I guess we'll save it. Oh, and we got another slab. Oh, wow, that's a heavy bag of book. We got another slab down there. Save that for last. Wow, that's a lot of books. He is very generous with the books. Let's see, we got Justice League of America, number six. Oh, now we got a wasp. Oh, sorry about that. I'm glad this wasn't. One of my a silver age or a bronze age, I just try to swat a wasp with. But the Batman Detective Comics 974. Uh, here's a hefty bag of books here. Complete four issue set of 2002 JLA Destiny. Pretty neat covers. Let's see, Spider Woman number one, J. Scott Campbell variant. I think everybody and their brother has one of those, but I did not. So, Invincible Iron Man. This one's in Mylar. Ryan Stegman, Invincible Iron Man cover. He says 9.6 on the back. I don't, I don't know. I guess I don't know why it'd only be a 9.6. I don't see a blemish on the cover. But Mark Wade, History of the Marvel Universe variant cover by Xavier Rodriguez. The Boys, Toronto Comic Con variant. Who's that? The boys, what? Number one? 18. WWE NXT TakeOver Proving Grounds. That's an unusual one. I don't know. Proving Ground number one Virgin Variant. I never even heard of that comic. I didn't know they had comics. Oh, here's a neat one. ROM number one. Comic Con variant. That's a neat looking cover. I like that. A lot neater than the old Bronze Age ones. Let's see, action figure cover variant. Secret Empire Storm. Let's see, number one X Men and the Micronauts, number one. Fantastic Four, number 88. Tor, number one. Yeah, I remember I used to buy these books when I was little. I love these Conan and Tarzan type books, dinosaurs. Oh, got another one. Another one just like I used to buy. Spider-Man, Kazar. Spider-Man. It's 
Two's R. Number nine. X Factor number two, first appearance of Artie Maddox. Here's another Bronze Age. Green Lantern, Green Arrow, number 99. And finally, an autographed The Gift Number One by Raven Gregory. Neat. I can't forget I got that slab book down there. Still got that to look at. But I got these bonus books too. Let's see what we got. Better than any uh, any shirt, I'll tell you that. Bonus books. Let's see what we got. The new 52 features end. The Incredible Hulk 396. Captain Britain and MI 13, number 10. I've never heard of that. It looks kind of interesting though. What is that? A Morbius looking cover. The Dark Seed War Justice League, number 47. New Superman Justice League of China, final issue number 24. Nomen Omen, number two. I've never heard of that. What a name, Nomen Omen. Astro City, number two. The Authority, Number two, Dark Horse Anthem, Strong Alone, number two, Marvel Civil War, Battle Damage Report, And a Batman 440. Not bad. Let's see what we got waiting for us at the bottom of this box. Alright, I'll show you guys first. What do we get? Eight point nine point eight. Oh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, number 96, 9.8. Very cool. Thanks, Grant. Nice box. I don't know how you do it for 75 bucks. That's a good deal. This is uh, Steve, Super Mario Retro. Talk to you later.